Hey, what's up guys? This is Video Bob. Check it out. Uh, just got in a new pan. This is my new Mont Blanc, James Dean. Now this is a special edition and this is the fountain pen version. And uh, we'll open it up. Let's see, how does this open? Open this way. Nope, open this way. <laughs> okay. Okay, comes with a nice little booklet here. Tells you all about the pen, or for you purist, the writing instrument. Very nice book. And here's the presentation box. Much like some of their other boxes. And here it is. Now, this is their fountain pen. It uh, will unscrew. Comes with a medium sized nib. And I have uh, some blue ink in there. But uh, real quickly before we get too far, uh, just for fun, uh, as part of the collection, they offer a James Dean, uh, it's called Rebel Red, 50 milliliter bottle of red ink. So I had to have that with it, even though I'm not going to use the red ink. Well, I'm not going to use the red ink because you can't use red ink when you're writing checks and certain documents because it doesn't photocopy very well. That's the reason why. So I won't be using that. I'll be using this, which is a permanent blue, it's called. This is good for writing checks and documents and things. It photocopies well. It's called the permanent blue. So uh, that's what I have in the pen now. And that's what I'll be using. So there's a lot of history with this thing. You, you, you have this, this red color, same color as his Porsche. And Mont Blanc hasn't offered a lot of pens in red, and I love red. Now I'd like to, just real quick, uh, one of my everyday pens I carry is their Pix line, which is I think only available online. It's just a small little lightweight little pen and it's good for just carrying around they're about 200 bucks they're kind of cheap the red on it is a, is a little bit different a little bit more orangey a little bit closer to their M series line which I don't really like it's a little too modern and you know contemporary for me I this is just a nice thin little everyday pen but I will say they're fragile I've already put a crack in it and I need to get it fixed it's a little wobbly so uh, they're delicate but they're cheap they don't sell them in their stores you can get only get them online one of my other favorites is the Marilyn Monroe Muse. I did a video about this and the fakes, and you can see that it's a very different color of red, and I prefer the color of this red a little bit more. Now, this is a roller ball. It's much like a lipstick, and I went into this in more detail in one of my other videos. One of the things I don't like about this pen is the gold. I prefer the chrome a silver look you know this one this pen is very feminine but I love the red I mean it's got a pearl and the gold and the red it's a very feminine pen but it's beautiful it's a wonderful pen uh, also available in a ballpoint and a fountain pen as well as the roller bowl and the James Dean comes in all three of those as well but I had never had a fountain pen before and I thought I would make this my first um, incredibly easy I like the spring-loaded clip here this right here is like a bullet. Let me zoom in a little so you can see some of the detail here. And inscribed along the top, it says, live as if you'll die today. Dream as if you'll live forever. It's number one engraved here. You can see a serial number up here. Or no, that's not a serial number. I apologize. This is James Dean's born and death date up on top. And um, let's see, see if there's anything else. I, I believe these are GPS coordinates of probably where he wrecked his car and died. I'll have to verify that, but I believe that's what that is. Um, how morbid.
comes with their standard medium nib. I wish they would put the broader tips on these. They will give you the broader tip for free, but you got to mail it into like Germany or something. Um, but I have tried riding with it. It's, it is quite easy to use. For those of you that don't know how to use it, you just, um, Maybe zoom, pull back a little. You know, you drop this down into the ink well, you unscrew this, and it sucks it up, then you screw it back down, and it's as simple as that. It's really easy, and actually, I had filled it up with red, used it for a while, rinsed it out with water, and then refilled it with the blue ink. It was really easy to do. So if you've never owned a one of their fountain pens, it's actually quite easy to use, and it works just like a regular pen. It just doesn't have the smooth rolling action that a roller bowl has. It's a little bit more scratchy. But it is interesting, you know, I, I, I tried writing my signature on the back of this envelope here. And, you know, it, it does have a nice little flow on it, you know. I like, I like the way it works. Um, not sure what else I could tell you, but I can tell you that the retail on this is uh, just about a thousand bucks. But it's not available anymore. It's discontinued. It was a very limited edition. You may still find some of these in store. I know there was one at the North Park Mall. Mont Blanc store here in Dallas. Um, I actually bought this online. Got it on eBay for about 800 bucks. I saved a little bit of money buying it online, but very soon you won't be able to get these at all. So I think if you are interested in this, and this will be a sought after collector, collector's item in my opinion, I think you should go ahead and grab one. And quite frankly, unless you really need to use it, I just leave it in the box and stash it because I think this is going to be one of those kind of Mont Blanc collectibles that's probably going to sell for two, three thousand bucks pretty quickly. I think people are going to want it and they're not going to be able to get it. Uh, I really dig the, um, this is supposed to be, I guess, denim or something, but it, it adds an extra texture for holding. And um, I like it. It's, it's very well made. It's incredibly beautiful. It's very poignant. Uh, I like, you know, I, I like when you have the sentiment of living for today because tomorrow may not be here. And um, that is very true. Um, you know, um, I don't want to get too deep into that, but I've just lost a lot of friends. And so I kind of live my life. The reason I enjoy these luxury items like these is because I know that uh, every moment is fleeting. And uh, what are you going to die with? All your money in the bank? I mean, it's a, it's a very expensive pen if you're not used to buying fine items. Um, but it seems that the people that are into this channel, the people that enjoy luxury items, they enjoy Rolls Royce cars, Rolex watches, and Mont Blanc pens. It's just they go hand in hand. And um, some of the most historical documents in American history or in world history have been signed by Mont Blanc. And so I love red. Uh, I love chrome. I love black. Uh, this is my colors. It's a beautiful, beautiful writing instrument. I'm so glad I have it. Not meant to be a flex video, but just kind of showing you what's available out there. There's only about f four, well actually three, because this pen is no longer available, but you can see the different colors. Um, the M series pen is the other one that's a little closer to this orangey color here. You can kind of see how the shades change between them. You can still get the Marilyn Monroe Muse series in all three versions. Uh, you can kind of find these in stores, but they're no longer on their website. The picks are no longer are not on their in their stores, but on their website. So, just thought I'd mention that again. Hey, I, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you really uh, liked it and. Um, if you're a collector, I encourage you to get one of these. They're very, very beautiful. They come in a twist. They come in a roller ball. But really, I think the fountain pen is is the is the cream of the crop. So, anyway, hey, thanks again. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I'm Video Bob. Mm -hmm.